So this one is made from wood. It is anywhere. The bowl I showed you earlier that you can grind pepper in it. This is the wooden one. In fact, I've never seen this type before in my entire life. All right. So yes. Yeah, so just appreciate this one. This one is made of wood. again for the comments i am so glad to be on your screen once again in fact i must apologize for not bringing you videos as often as possible this whole year but yes we are back from the commercial break today i'm at the whole market once again to bring you very exciting scenes from the market over here the last time i came here was with titana aina and myself came to explore the whole market Today I have come alone just to uh, show you how the whole market looks like. This is just a walkthrough video through the whole market. We want to show you how our market looks like. Please subscribe to the channel, like this video, share to your friends and families. Let's go. Okay, so uh this is the entrance of the whole market and uh as you can see there are cucumbers the okro cabbage and uh, other ones okay so if you come to the whole market uh today is not a market day so this is how the market looks like on a normal uh, day like this but i bet you on a market day when you come here there is traffic in fact what to pass uh you will not get but then just look at today an ordinary day and the number of people who are here people who are busy uh, uh, with they are buying and selling and all that uh, i like this thing so much and i know how to do it when i was young and i was in the village i used to do this we call it papa in eve or in english you can just say fan when you about setting uh, fire in your cool pot you use this one to fan the fire for it to uh, to burn very well so this is a papa or fan yeah so we move to the next places or the other places so that we show you more things but before i move also this is what we call broom this is broom a typical uh, traditional broom which we use to sweep our rooms and our compound when it's dirty yes this one is made from um, the palm front yes this one is, we have different kinds there are some which are made from the coconut front but this one is from the palm front okay so just continue to watch this video and you get to discover a lot from home market home market is a one-stop shop for every other person in and around home to come shop for their families thank you let's move on i go yeah so the last time i came to the market with tatiana aina uh, we showed you food items from the okra to the fish to the cassava dough and all that but today i am not interested in food items what i am interested in is 
some of the things we use in our homes like our papa just, just like i showed you earlier yes and then some other things like maybe the mortar a to a to yamako to na dele a to yamako to na fufule ple love your kata that is what we are interested in showing to you so let's move on and you'll be amazed with what we have for you today thank you And in fact, we, we must appreciate our market women, our parents who come to the market here to sell. In fact, look at the sun. The sun is very high and very scorchy. So, if your mother sells in the market, you must always appreciate her because, in fact, it's not easy at all. Look at how I am sweating. In fact, I cannot do this work. So if your mother, your father works in the market, always be appreciative of them. Their effort uh, is, is, is not easy at all. It's not easy. All right. All right. Uh, I have one interesting uh implement here uh do you know how it is called we call it koji in every in every we call it koji in the same ever a different variation or uh, a different kind of ever uh that is the vodoma people call it aglenu aglenu but the anglos will say koji so this is koji and uh, this is uh, this is our caterpillar <laughs> Our tractor, this is what we used to read. Uh, our farms. Uh, I wish I could demonstrate how it is used. But you see, this place uh, it, it has a very sharp edge, and this is what you, you do it this way to read around. Yes, and uh, uh, this is Cutlass. This is Cutlass or Machet also for weeding farms and what have you okay so this is what i said i was going to show you in this video today yes basic implement basic tools we use in our farms in our homes all right so i've already spoken about the fan the papa and all that so it's now the turn of this implement agricultural implement all right so the same kind of room i showed you earlier this one is from the palm tree or the palm front all right because i already spoke about this i will not go so much into it but the other one i am interested in is this one you see the height uh, as compared to this one you realize that this one is longer this one is shorter all right so this one is from the coconut tree this one too you can use it to sweep your compound or if possible you can use it to sweep your room so far as it is long as tall as myself you can even use it to remove cobwebs in your room okay so you come to the Vuta region you see this is very common to a typical Ghanaian is very very common all right and the next one i want to talk about is the standing broom okay that one when you are sweeping you don't bend but you stand so let me show you the standing broom so this is the standing broom uh, okay so this is standing broom okay uh, it, this one is also made from the coconut front and uh, it's added a stick is added to it just to make it tall for you to sweep so you hold it this way 
and then you soup with it. So this is the standing broom. It's very common uh, when you get to the coastal areas, especially. You get to Keta, you see it, you get to Aflau. Yes, because coconut trees are more dominant over there in these areas. So these things are brought from the coastal areas like Aflau, Agbozume, all those sites. Yes, you can get this to buy in bulk. All right. Okay, today I want to blow your mind. You know what I'm holding? We call it Bagba in Ewe. And this one is also called Tapolini in Ewe. Now, before the blender was introduced or made, this used to be our traditional blender. This is where we grind our pepper and this is the masha. So you put your pepper in it and then you grind it. You can also blend or mash your sweet cane cake in this one. What have you, when you are cooking, you want to grind your, uh, or you want to mash your okra, you can do it all in this one. So this serves a lot of purposes, okay? But you know these days because of blender, so many people, so many ladies, so many women do not want to grind pepper again in this. So, please, let's revisit this one to make our meal so delicious in our homes. Thank you. So, you might be wondering where this one too is coming from. <laughs> this one too is coming from the market. Yeah, so this one in every we call it Zelega. In every we call it Zelega. Now, what do we use this one for? It helps you to hold down your cooking pot. You see this side of the cooking pot? This is where you insert the hook, this metal, this Zelega here, just to hold it down when you are preparing your banku. So, uh, this is Zelega, and that is what it is used for. So, the question is. Can you use this on a stove? No. Maybe if the stove is the one you place on the floor, then you can use this one. But if the standing one, I bet you, you will not be able to use this one. Yes, yeah, so that is the purpose or the reason why the craftsman have decided to do this one, just to help you in the kitchen when you are cooking. Thank you. All right, so as you can see, lots of full staffs. Uh, yeah, so this is Jumi. Jumi is here. Yeah, so lots of full staffs, vegetables, fish, and all that. Uh, you can see, or you can get to buy in whole market. So different kinds of spices. Yes. So different kinds of spices. I don't 